there are few secret hidden benefits on NoFap that only few people know, even though the other 99% of people who are actually on NoFap aren't even aware of. So simply by listening to this video, you can go and steal this opportunity from them and use it to your advantage. This thing allowed me to actually become this person from a guy who used to masturbate 30 times a day to a guy who is currently able to live the life that many people can only dream of. So the number one benefit that you get on NoFap is control. If you want to know more about control, click the first link in the description and I'm going to show you. But I'm going to explain it short term right now. Control is something that you most likely never had in your life. So far you may have thought, oh, but I'm in control. In reality, whose house are you living in? You most likely grew up with your parents. You most likely got risen up by someone else. You most likely had someone make you food, had someone wash your clothes, had someone t give you a haircut, had someone take care of you. And you did not know how to take control over your life. In fact, whenever you wanted to take control, whenever you were asked to take control, whenever in school you were given the leadership role, you always kind of got this heart tightening feeling where in some sense it feels good, but in some sense it doesn't feel good because you're just not ready mate. You're not ready. So in reality you're kind of confused. I want control but I don't actually want it. What is happening? You don't want control because you don't know how to control. And the way to learn this is through progressive overload. Start taking your life in your hands. Is your mother cooking you food right now? Is your family deciding whether you will exercise or not? Is your something something deciding what you will do in your life? Take control by starting that first. Find your purpose. And the easiest way to find it is to basically get a direction as to what you actually want to do in life. A simple question that you can actually journal about and wonder and ponder about is this question where you ask yourself, what would I do for 20 years down the line, for 20 hours a day without getting paid, but I would still enjoy it every single day? If you cannot find an answer, fair enough. If you can find an answer, go and list few things out as to what would you enjoy. Even if you can't find an answer, bro, just answer what do you enjoy in life. And boom, now you have a direction as to where you actually want to go in life. As a simple example, perhaps you enjoyed fighting whenever you were a child. You go on and join a martial arts club. It doesn't have to be anything in specific. Let's start with wrestling. You don't enjoy wrestling for the first three months. Move on to the next thing, move on to the next thing, move on to the next thing until you meet something which is, for example, called Muay Thai. And inside Muay Thai, everything just goes smoothly. You're just so quick. Everything is going well. You're beating everyone up. You go to a tournament and you get first place just like that. And you feel like it's easy. That's the purpose that you want to follow in life. So now you took full control because thanks to this purpose, now you can earn your own money. Now you can live your own life. Now you can get your own house and build your own social circle. It, you don't have to rely upon school to, for them to give you friends. You don't have to rely upon something else to give you the food, upon someone else to give you the shelter. You are in control. And once you quit masturbation, you literally take control from your subconscious mind in your hands. And now you're the guy on the horse who just goes around and actually does something that he enjoys with his own life. And you only get this once you take control from your own vicious self. And that vicious self isn't a demon. It's basically habits that were stacked upon each other. And now your own subconscious mind has programs that literally contain things that you don't want in life. That time when you feel nervous whenever you were about to speak with a girl. It's your subconscious mind, a program of your subconscious mind. When you gave up, even though there was only one second, that's your subconscious mind. Whenever you feel fear, 
because someone else familiar approaches and you don't know what to do, that's your subconscious mind. It's a program. And the best way to actually crack the code and get this control and become the person that I am currently today and hopefully someone even better is to actually go on and start being present in the moment. You can have multiple arrays of things that you can actually do. I have found that following the breath is one of the easiest things to do. So it's basically called meditation. And if you have ever watched a fire just burn and that's it, you meditated right there and then. Because whenever you watch a fire, I can tell you for a fact that, that, that there probably is no thoughts at all. Because something so fascinating just happens in front of your eyes right now. So you're not gonna miss this opportunity. You'll be present whenever you go a waterfall and you watch the water falling. You again watch something which is so fascinating so you are not gonna go and just look away or get distracted. But sadly we can't have fire or water just rolling somewhere everywhere we go. But there is something that accompanies you even when you sleep. And that is your own breath. And what I want you to do right now is take a deep breath in and slowly exhale it and follow it. Just like this. You can have few focus points. The belly, the chest, wherever you feel it the most. The lungs, the point of your nose where it actually enters and leaves. Somewhere where you can actually focus. So go and do something like this, start meditating, start taking care of your mental health and then you have the leash of your own horse and now you are in control of your life because now you are able to focus and notice yourself, notice those fucking fucked up subconscious programs are ruining your life. You're able to notice the fear before it even comes. So now you're just, fuck you, bro. I'm not gonna be fearful. I'm not gonna be scared. And you go and approach the girl. You go and do the stuff. And you go and do the deed. That's what we are talking about. And one day you can just have this. I chose the path of self-improvement. And this is the result all over me. Some people choose the path of ruin. And it's your choice. You can either go on, meditate, Take care of your mental and physical health. Educate yourself and live life the way you were supposed to be, with your purpose. Or you can just go on and live under a bridge and have someone else, have big daddy or big mommy telling you what to do. Your choice. I'm just here to help you. Thank you, brother. And again, if you have come to the end of this video, first of all, you know which choice to make. It's obvious because you decided to watch this video. So you are in control while you're watching this video alone. And second of all, click the first link in the description to join my free school community where every single Saturday I answer and help you out with questions. Peace.